So, dear students, uh, we have this question. Find the zeros of the quadratic polynomial uh, given here 4 root 3 x square plus 5 x uh, minus 2 root 3. Uh, and uh, we have to verify the relation between zeros and the coefficient. Today, I am going to show you uh, how to find the uh, factors of it, how to factorize, how to find the zeros. Then remaining relationship between uh, zeros and its coefficients, uh, you can try for it. Okay. Uh, so first of all, I, I, so let us uh, find the product. The product means you have to multiply these two numbers. When we multiply uh, 4 root 3 into, so plus 4 root 3 into negative 2 root 3, which is equal to 8 into 3, which is equal to 24. Uh, then 5 uh, we have uh, sum as 5 here so we have written the sum as uh, 5 uh, sum is 5 and the product is here 24 so let us see the factors of uh, 24 uh, if you see that uh, 8 into 3 is 24 when we multi uh, uh, subtract 8 minus 3 is equal to 5 so we got this 5 here so 8 into 3 24 and 8 minus 3 5 so we got the two numbers so our numbers are 8 and 3 here it's clear that 8 is positive and we can write uh, 3 is uh, negative positive 8 and negative 3 so uh, that is clear so we can write uh, 8 and minus 3 here okay so we can write x minus 3 so, sorry here positive 8 so we can write x plus 8 and x minus 3 next uh, next step we have to uh, divide this uh, these numbers 8 and 3 by the coefficient of x square that is we have to write as divided by 4 root 3 and this is also divided by uh, 4 uh, 4 root 3 okay and now uh, listen carefully then the 4 and 2 we can uh, 8 and cancel two times so we, this we can write as the same thing we can write as uh, x plus 2 root 2 upon root 3 and this side we can write as uh, carefully listen 3 we can write as root 3 into 3 root 3 into root 3 3 we can write as root 3 into 3 divided by 4 into root 3 4 into root 3 so uh, so these two we can cancel and uh, so what is remain x minus root 3 by 4 f, f of x uh, is equal to uh, so we can write that is equal to 0 we can make it as equal to 0 so uh, now uh, now we can write as we have the two factors here so x plus uh, 2 by root 3 into x minus root 3 by 4 is so equal to 0. So we can get x is equal to minus 2 by root 3 uh, another one x is equal to root 3 by 4. So these are the things uh, so we can find out uh, in this way we can find the zeros. Let, next let us write the Next, let us write the next. Let us verify the relation between the zeros and the coefficients. Let alpha is equal to minus two by three, and beta is equal to root three by four. First, find find the sum of zeros. That is alpha plus beta which is equal to 2 by 2 by root 3 plus root 3 by 4 so let us uh, do as usual the cross multiplication if you do the cross multiplication we get uh, minus 2 into 4 is 8 and uh, root 3 root 3 into root 3 that is 3 plus 3 divided by root 3 into 4 4 root 3 root 3 into 4 we have to write as 4 root 3 so which is equal to uh, minus uh, 5 by 4 root 3 minus 5 by 
four root three. Let us uh, find out what is minus of coefficient of x square. Uh, coefficient of uh, x divided by coefficient of x square which is nothing but minus of b by a which is equal to um, why we are saying it is b by a so because quadratic, quadratic equation we can write in the format of ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0. This is the quadratic equation we have the general format and the quadratic polynomial in the general format. We have the quadratic polynomial in the general format. Uh, so minus b by a is equal to uh, what is that? This relation. So, we have the value of minus of b which is the coefficient of uh, x that is 5 divided by uh, coefficient of x square that is 4 root 3. Both are same, right? So, we can say that therefore uh, sum of zeros is equal to coefficient of uh, x divided by coefficient of x square. Let us see the product of zeros that is alpha beta is equal to. Uh, these two we can multiply minus 2 by root 3 uh, into root 3 by 4. So we can get the answer as the 4 and 2 we can cancel two times. Uh, so remaining this is 1 is there we can multiply 1 into root 3 root 3 divided by uh, 2 into root 3 2 root 3 root 3 root 3 we can cancel. So remaining we can write y minus uh, 1 by 2. Okay, let us find out uh, what is uh, coefficient uh, constant term divided by coefficient of x square. Constant term c divided by co con uh, coefficient of x square, which is equal to c by a. That is equal to what is uh, c value? C means this constant term minus 2 by root 3 divided by a means co con uh, coefficient of x square 4 by root 3. So root 3 root 3 cancel 1 time 1 goes uh, in 4 2 2 2 is there. So minus 1 by 2 both are same. So we can say that some product of zeros is equal to coefficient of x square co constant divided by coefficient of x square. So thank you for watching.